Hello. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. Ooh, it's like being at sea. Uh, hello, it's Henry uh, um, with another poem uh, on the epic tour. Um, as I can't be doing the epic tour around uh, um, Nottinghamshire uh, for the libraries for Inspire, I'm going to be doing them uh, for um, anybody actually. Uh, um, but uh, if you're in Nottinghamshire, um, especially for you, I suppose. And uh, especially for Inspire, uh, I'm not sure exactly where they're going to be placed, but um, you found it anyway. <laughs> so uh, where am I at the minute? So I'm touring my house, uh, um, and this is uh, this is Johnny's painting room, uh, studio, you could say, if you're being posh. Uh, um, this is his latest. He did this today. So uh, now you won't be able to make this out, but it actually says "Stay at home." Now, by the time he's finished it, you will make it out. Uh, um, maybe it's subliminal. Let's have a look at that. Can you see? Yeah, maybe it's subliminal. So, uh, um, as you see, he's got lots of paintings knocking around. Uh, some he did the other day. Uh, this is all the corner. That's where all his paints are. Uh, if you can see them there. Quite messy. But then I always think uh, with creativity, it's sort of... Um, you need it a bit messy, don't you? It's like order and chaos. Uh, you've got to make order out of chaos and a little bit of chaos uh, out of out of order. So um, do your poem. Uh, um, oh, when I sit myself down, there we go. Um, and I thought I'd do a poem uh, about um, Johnny and Angela. Uh, Angela's my wife. Is that going to work? Yeah, there we go. Um, from this book here. I'm going to move you around there because I've realised that you've got to be careful with the lighting. Of these things if the light's too bright behind you you can't see. We're all learning. Right so this is called uh, When Words Are Not Your First Language. This is about uh, um, me looking at uh, Angela and Johnny when uh, when Johnny was ill. And it sort of goes out to any parent. Um, obviously my lad uh, was autistic so um, he couldn't really tell you when he was ill. Um, but obviously we could see was ill and you, you do get to know somebody and read them. When words are not your first language. Any parent would sooner be ill than their child. This is... Start again. Any parent would sooner be ill than their child. There is an helplessness. Johnny can't quite get the hang of blowing his nose. His top lip gets raw, like bacon in the pan. I wince. I close my eyes to steal myself. Strangely, he allows more contact than poorly. He loses his edges. His lovableness is irresistible. Patience and distraction are the only prescription. His mum throws her heart into bamboozling him through the worst. With such attention and diversion, you could call it just an everyday devotion. There are no words for what passes here. I hope you're enjoying the uh, poems and I um, hope you'll uh, check out uh, the other poets doing uh, stuff and uh, maybe even post a, a poem yourself. That would be nice. Uh, stay safe, stay healthy and uh, as Johnny says, stay at home.